gorgeouses. My name is Kari. I'm a face yoga instructor. So if you're still having a hard time mewing, part of that is going to be tongue exercises. Lots of tongue strength needed in order to really open this area. And then there might need to be more space on the upper palate. I want you to work on widening the upper palate. So what we want is we want the, the mouth to start widening and lifting up. So opening up and widening the upper palate. And how do we do that? Cheekbone lift. So take your index fingers on the cheekbone, thumbs against the palate. So I'm pressing my thumbs against the palate, not against the teeth. It might look like they're pressing against the teeth, but they're not. The pressure is on the, th on the tips of my thumbs. Take your fingers up against your palate and massage the palate. Really inhale through the nose while you do this little palate massage, massaging outwards and forwards, outwards and forwards, outwards. And imagine the palate widening. And really visualize the upper palate expanding horizontally and forward for about 30 seconds. We're gonna really simplify everything. Imagine you have your teeth and then on the other side you have your tongue and on the other side you have your cheeks and your lips. You have the force of the tongue on the palate but let's just say it's, it's acting indirectly onto the teeth. The force of the tongue and then the force of the cheeks acting against the teeth. So if the cheeks are stronger than the tongue, the palate's gonna collapse. The teeth are gonna cave in. If the tongue is stronger than the cheeks, the palate will expand, okay? So essentially you want your tongue to become stronger than your cheeks in a very simplified way in order to expand your upper palate, okay? We wanna expand it wide and forward. I want you to work on that tongue to be a bigger force, a stronger force than the cheeks. Now the soft palate is the area behind the hard palate that we want to get our tongue all the way up to. So from behind the teeth, behind the ridges, all the way up the palate, all the way to the soft palate, the soft bit behind the bone of your hard palate. And by lifting the soft palate, that helps us to kind of engage and make connection to the soft palate, which is where we're gonna want our tongue ultimately to be. So hope that was helpful, you guys. Let me know in the comments what you think about those types of ways of thinking about it. Don't forget to like this video if it was helpful for you and to subscribe if you want more content like this. And have a great day.